<laughs> hey YouTube, it's me, Zipster. Well, I don't know what the hell is going on with these computers. So today I finally got back on YouTube using my desktop, but not through Firefox, Fox Fire, whatever. I go through like Internet Explorer. I don't know what's going on. And then it, I was stored to an earlier day, and then my camera got all kafluki. And look, now I can't adjust the color or anything. It looks like I've been sitting in a tanning salon with Britney Spears all day or something. But anyway, yeah, so I just came back. Right up the street, we had this little uh, this little store. It used to be a 7-Eleven, you could tell, you know. You could tell, just tell. But um, now it's not a 7-Eleven. It's called Easy Shop. E Z shop, right? So I go, I go up there for my cigarettes because I don't like to buy. Um, I go up there every day, as a matter of fact, because I don't like to buy cartons. Because if I have a carton around, then I'll smoke like a whole bunch of them. But if I limit myself a little bit, then it stays a lot better. Anyway, so I've been noticing, you know, I go up there and there's always the same old people hanging around. Yeah, I know, like what you're saying. Yeah, well, you're old. Yeah, well, I'm not that old. These people are old. And there's always like 10 of them. They're always hovering around over by the section where they sell the lottery tickets. And they like never go home. They're, oh, they're there like all day. Well, I usually go in the afternoon and they're always there. But I just, it's you know, it's like dark and late now. And I go up there and they're still all hovering around. And they like never leave. They like get their little scratch offs. And then they walk outside and they scratch them all off. And then they come back in and they, you know, free ticket. And then they take that and they go outside. And they don't talk to each other. This is what really kills me. Like if I know who they are, they must recognize each other because they spend all day there together. But they don't even talk to each other. It's like they're, it's like they're like these athletes on different teams you know like like it's so competitive this thing it's like oh i'm not going to talk to them because they might get that lucky lottery ticket and then where's that going to leave me but i just thought it was really spooky and then i'm thinking i thought old people didn't have a lot of money i mean i thought we, we this country was going to hell in a handbag because i don't know social security some kind i don't really pay attention to that stuff but i'm thinking you know man they could be spending that money on some cat food so they'd have something to eat at home Maybe they just eat cat food right there, right out of the can, right outside the door, in between scratching off the lottery tickets. I don't know. I just think it's really weird. Why do these old people have this fascination with lottery tickets? Ugh. I'll never understand. Okay. That's all. Later. Bye. Thank you. <laughs>